Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing this absolutely adorable tractor. I picked the colors bright green and yellow to resemble a John Deere color scheme. So first I'm lining up all my transfers to make sure that everything fits on my board perfectly. I've pre-mixed my colors so that they have a nice yogurt consistency. And now I'm fuzzing the transfer on my leg so that the transfer will not stick too much to the board. Oh, we have an adjustment issue. Give me a second here. And we are good. Okay, so I have it fuzzed because if you do not fuzz your transfer before, it will stick too much to the board. And when you peel it off, it will wreck whatever work you did previously. Just lining up my transfer nice again and getting it prepped and ready to go, making sure there is no bubbles in my transfer. Next, I'm dipping into this gorgeous bumblebee yellow and going ahead and putting a generous amount over all the open spots on my transfer. Now I'm squeegeeing off the excess amount on the transfer so we don't have any waste left behind. Gently peeling, it re reveals the first layer of our beautiful tractor portrait. And there's a picture of my sloth. Okay, back to business. Now we're blow drying the first layer so that it doesn't stick to the second layer. Once again, peeling off the transfer and putting it on my leg to fuzz it so it does not stick too much to the board. This is a very vital, important part for any procedure involving these transfers. Once again, taking the bubbles up and dipping into this beautiful bright green. Once again, putting a great amount on top of all the silk screen areas, squeegeeing off any excess amount so we don't have any waste at all. Once I've completed that, I will gently remove the transfer revealing our beautiful green and yellow John Deere schemed tractor. Next I'm going to want to do the letters, that tractor life. So I'm going to gently peel it off of the backing and fuzz it once again as this is one of the most important steps. Now I'm going to make sure everything's all nice and lined up and measured properly because I am not using a traditional chalk couture board and I'm just using a normal board. So whatever I do on here is permanent. Everything's straight, everything's good, and we're ready to go. Now I couldn't decide if I wanted to go yellow or green, green or yellow. In the end, I decided to do tractor life in yellow and that in green. Once again, putting a nice amount over top of the letters and squeegeeing off the excess amount. Making sure I do not cross the colors so it has a nice clean lettering left over. And there you have it. There is our That Tractor Life sign in the scheme of John Deere. Really impressed with how it worked out. If you get a chance, go over and check out my Backwoods Creation Instagram pro profile, like my page, and of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more transfers. I'll be doing that sloth one next. Anyways, here's the finished project. Hope you enjoyed.